Hello guys, welcome into this new video. So let's take a look of how we can trade, how we can send our USDT tokens here from our MetaMask wallet into the Binance uh, account. So first of all, guys, you can see I have connected my account into my Binance account here. So what I want to do is to find the custom token, my USDT. If you, if you don't see your assets right uh, in your account, what you can do is to go what you can do is to go into the cryptocurrencies of coinmarketcap.com so you can find your USDT contract. So after I found my token, I want to select the option that says contracts. I want to go into more. And once I find the contract here, I'm going to copy the address and add it to MetaMask. I'm going to go into MetaMask once again. I'm going to go down and pull tokens. I want to paste the token contract address we just find and add custom token here so I can see my assets right in here. So what I want to do now is to select a network that I can be using for sending my money. In this case, I'm going to use my smart chain. If you want to use your Ether, you can use that. But I'm using smart chain because I'm saving a lot of money using the smart chain. So, so after I select my smart chain network, I want to go and it says send to. And this one is going to be asking us for a public address. So let's go into Binance and let's go into our wallet and fiat and spot. So once we are in here, what you guys want to do is to select the option that says deposit. Now it says select your coin. I want to select USDT and deposit to which network. Okay, so what you guys want to do is to select the network that you were using exactly the same network that you're using into MetaMask. In my case, I'm using VMV, the smart chain. So that's the reason why I want to select VMV smart chain here. And then it's going to be popping up a new address where I have to click to copy here. And then I want to go into my MetaMask once more. And then I can select my USDT, send. I'm going to paste my public address. And this is the address detected here. This is the asset. And you just need to put the amount that you want to be sending into the account and just key it into next. In my case, it says insufficient tokens here, but let's say I want to hear BMV so that you can see guys what's going to be looking like next. So I want to do the maximum amount here. And after I hit into next, it this is the estimate gas fee is going to be costing me. Uh, it's not too much. This is the total amount and just go into confirmed. So once you have done that, guys, what you guys want to do is to go back into your Binance account, go into the fiat and spot, and you can see that your transaction might be available now into your assets here. But just in case that you haven't seen that, you, you can go into your MetaMask, go into the activity section, and here in the transactions, you must see the transaction we just did a few seconds ago. And if this one says pending, it says that we need to wait uh, a couple more minutes in order to be sending our funds into Binance. So it's a very easy way that you can see and you can send your tokens for MetaMask into Binance, guys. If you want to send another coin, it's exactly the same process. Just remember to use exactly the same network and the same address. Otherwise, you might be losing your token. So be really careful for that. Let me know if you have any question. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, guys, if you want to see more about Binance or MetaMask. Thank you for watching the video and I'll see you guys next time.